Hey everybody, Dr. Mohair, and I'm going to show you how to escape school. Piggy, the result of isolation. So basically what you want to do is grab the white key, unlock the door, turn around, and grab the camera. FNFA, FNFA, FNAF, Five Nights at Freddy style. Anyways, I'm not good with that. So what you do is you wait till it changes colors, then you press the back button and you come over here, and then you're going to grab the pick. Alright, so I'm just going to walk through this again. It, you know, you probably got to understand the map, learn it a little bit, but basically you're going to run over here to the stairs, run down, and run all the way down here, and then you're going to take a left. I've done this a few times, so wait a second. I said left. I had already did the left. Okay, so you run into the dead end wall, use the pick, go through it. Now you take the left. Okay, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm trying to think about it ahead of time, and it's just not working. So there's a red key around here somewhere. There it is. All right, so the red key is actually upstairs. Uh, you'll notice there's another red key at the beginning of the game, but I went back and tried to use it. It didn't unlock. I was hoping it to be a jump scare or something, but nothing. Anyways, here is where you get the green key. And we're just going to walk back the way we came. There's a couple of different locations I found the red key, but it's all around the same vicinity. So we're going to walk the green key. Look at teacher is hanging there. That's kind of creepy, but whenever you walk close, teacher disappears or falls, then disappears. Anyways, we are going to the blue room. And we're going to walk over here. We're going to walk into the blue room and open it up. There is a orange key. We're going to grab the orange key. Go into the kitchen. This is where they're, they eat. Why is it not the kitchen? Maybe it's the cafeteria. Cafeteria, Dr. Mo. Anyways, I got the red gear. Now, a lot of times the green gear will be in there too. However, on this time, it wasn't. I'm looking for it. It's not here. And when it's not here, that means that it's... Well, yeah, you got it. It's somewhere else. But I'm going to show you where this one is because, of course, I did find it. Okay, so I'm looking downstairs. It could be here. I found the red key there. I found the red gear there. So, again, it's random spawns. It could be all over the place. But we're going to go back upstairs. And whenever we go upstairs to the right very first room... It's right there on the floor. I wasn't expecting that one, I'll be honest. I was not expecting it there because I found it even around the corner before. Again, that shows how many times I have done this and died. Okay, so now, like, where's where's the grain? Where does it go? That's what I want to know. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go here. And if you look to the right there, yeah, I didn't show it, but it actually is a letter that says, hey, this is what you do. Go to the room underneath the conference room. And that's where you want to meet. So I'm going to run over here to this room. All of a sudden, the wall closes behind me. And the door is closed. And then there is a big, bad people with 47 arms. Yes, that's right. 47. I've counted every single one of them. So basically, you're I'm running around. It's making like a tunnel. But I'm going over to the sewer. So I'm going to go down in the sewer. It is extremely, extremely extremely dark i don't know if i can you know elaborate on that any more than extremely but we are running down here there's three things you're going to need down here and one of them's a fire extinguisher one of them's the sword that's the sword right there and then there's a mop i need the mop first so i'm gonna go grab the mop that's where the mop is there might be a videotape over there too just saying if you use it you can't beat the chapter but it, it could be there so we're gonna run over here and whenever we do that, all of a sudden, out pops the big piggy. Now, this is like Mother from Forest, that piggy, which is weird because this piggy's bigger, badder, more dangerous, and has the same two heads. I mean, I, I don't, I'm not for sure we get it just yet. But I got the sword, and I'm going to I'm gonna hit, hit him with the sword. Now, I got to get the yellow key, so you got to be careful for the arms. I'm going to grab the yellow key and again sneak by and so here we will go over to the safe that's in here and that is where I will get the fire extinguisher so all right so that's the fire extinguisher now we're gonna run back over we are going to hit the big bad piggy monster with Alphys's head with that right there all right piggy got blown up now 
there's there's water there so you got to be careful let it drain you will die otherwise run on this side now i don't know if it matters but stay closer to the left side because you could die i died so many times on the right hand side for no reason grab the blue key before you go upstairs all of a sudden water is coming back in and it is going to kill you because it's raising right now so you need to get out of dodge get upstairs and to the very top level then you'll be okay now there's a purple key i just saw it but that's not what i need i need the blue key so i gotta run where is the blue key door inside the blue key door is obviously where you were gonna whoa there's alphas he's dead his head's missing so the big bad piggy monster mother took his head and put it on her head it's kind of it's kind of weird kind of weird like you can't see with that other head so like what is it is it like snake skin but it's an alligator like you're wearing like alligator skin like for fashion interesting right interesting i know there's like sewer water there so i'm trying to be careful okay so let's go ahead and grab that there's the purple key all right we're gonna run back over and take out the explosives that i used or that i got the purple key from with the explosives anyways we're going back around and we're gonna go all the way down um when i say all the way down like we're going all the way down and then we're going to not go to the right we're going to go down to the left we're going to go all the way down and all of a sudden you come to another dead end we're going to go all the way to the left and you should see somebody there is pony so before pony gets too far ahead something drops down because he doesn't want you to catch him kind of i don't know but now let's jump in the rabbit hole and that is the badge award all right so this is the Ending cutscene. Kid, don't come through. It's a huge dam down there. What? A dam? I don't know what that is, but it sounds fun. I'm coming down anyways because I don't listen. No, no, no. And then Georgie does tumble somersaults, tumble tots, tumble tots, somersaults. Anyways, Pony decides I'm going with you. I am going with you. I'm jumping down. And then we see Pony. Hey, kid, you here? It's dark in here. This place is dark. If only there was a... Boom, lights on. Whoa. There is Georgie. 